Hi everyone, welcome to Apple Tech page. Lot of iPhone users have been reporting that they are unable to join Xfinity Wi-Fi network on their iPhone. In this video, I will show you how to fix this issue. Make sure that you have entered the correct password for your Wi-Fi network. If it's wrong, you are unable to join the network. Solution 1 is Turn off private address. To do this, go to settings app. Tap on Wi-Fi. Now tap on info icon next to your connected Wi-Fi network. Here, turn off private address if it's turned on. Solution 2 is turn on airplane mode and turn off it. Open settings app on your iPhone. Now turn on airplane mode and wait for 30 seconds. Then disable airplane mode. Solution 3 is reboot your iPhone and Wi-Fi router. Go to settings app on your iPhone. Find and tap on general. Now scroll down to bottom and tap on shutdown. Drag the slide to power off slide to turn off your iPhone. Then wait for a few seconds and turn it on back. To restart your Wi-Fi router, unplug it from power source and wait for a few seconds, then plug back it. Solution 4 is select other network. To do this, go to settings app. Find and tap on Wi-Fi. Make sure that Wi-Fi is turned on, then tap other under other networks. In the name field, enter the exact name of the network, then tap security. Select the security type to WPA2 or WPA3. Next, tap other network to go back to previous screen. Now enter the Wi-Fi network password in the password field and tap join in the top right corner. Solution 5 is Reset Network Settings. This process resets your Wi-Fi networks and passwords, APN and VPN settings and cellular settings. Make sure that you know your Wi-Fi passwords. To do this, open Settings app. Scroll down and tap on General. Again scroll down and tap Reset. Select Reset Network Settings. Next, enter the passcode of your iPhone. In the pop-up window, tap Reset Network Settings to confirm this process. Solution 6 is Check for Software Update. First, connect your iPhone to Wi-Fi and open Settings app. Find and tap on General. Here, tap on Software Update. If Software Update is available, tap Download and Install. Solution 7 is Force Restart your iPhone. If you are using iPhone 8, 10, 11 and 12 series and iPhone SE second generation, then do the following steps to force restart. First, quickly press and release the volume up button. Next, quickly press and release the volume down button. Finally, press and hold the side button until you see the Apple logo. If you are using iPhone 7 and 7 Plus, then do the following steps to first restart. Press and hold the sleep or wake button and volume down button at the same time until the Apple logo appears. If you are using iPhone 6s Plus and earlier models, then do the following steps to first restart. Press and hold the home button and side or power button at the same time until you see the Apple logo. 
Thanks for watching this video. Do like, share and subscribe to Apple Tech page.